ABTA has launched revised animal welfare guidelines. Animal welfare is an important issue, with two-thirds of holidaymakers saying they care about the welfare of animals when on holiday. This might be animals in the wild, working animals such as camels or horses, or animals in captive environments. The guidelines are a tool to help travel companies manage animal welfare. They include basic welfare requirements and unacceptable practices. What do we mean by basic welfare requirements? Well, this is things like nutrition. Does the animal have appropriate food? Environment. Does the animal have sufficient space? Is the environment sufficiently complex? Health. Does the animal have access to a vet? And behaviour. Can the animal express natural behaviours? And these four domains will impact the mental state of the animal. The guidelines also have a revised list of just under 30 unacceptable practices. This is where experts have provided evidence there's a significant risk to animal welfare. And it includes things like elephant riding, elephant bathing, or walking with lions. The guidelines were developed with a range of stakeholders, including NGOs, zoological associations, animal welfare scientists, and our animal welfare working group, which is made up of travel companies that are managing animal welfare. I look forward to working with our members on implementing these revised guidelines.